So hello guys, after installing the software internet business promoter, I decided to play with it a little. So I'm just going to tell you, um, give you information about very important features that I found that we can do with this SEO and I'm not really sure that we can do it, that you guys can do it with any other software. Just because this one goes uh, step by step, st step by step by the things that um, you guys have to do to optimize your web pages. And um, in this main uh, window, uh, you can see step one, find the best keywords. Step two, optimize your web pages. Step three, optimize your backlinks. And step four, submit your website. Uh, as you guys can see, my project status for my Wix web page is 0%. And this is because this is the demo version. So that does it, it does not allow me to uh, actually do anything with it. It just allows me to play around. <laughs> so if you click any of the steps, for example, I think that step one is the most relevant so far because this is what we've talked about uh, for uh, a long time in our class. Um, if you click on it, you can see that uh, five questions appear. I thought that the most relevant one was how to choose the right keywords, considering that I was mistaken uh, when I chose mine. So if you click on it, um, you guys can see that this yellow box appears. And uh, uh, you can see the different types. It explains the different types of keywords, but especially and most relevant was uh, how to choose the, the, the keywords for people to search. And as you guys can see in this last paragraph, it says, most people use a two to four word phrase in a search. So phrases are very effective. Single words cannot be promoted effectively because they're not very targeted. And yeah, obviously this was a mistake because for my web page, my keyword slash um, meta tags were things like recipes, healthy, food, coma, all of that. So it was obviously not effective. And later, later on by reading more, I figured that in this feature, keywords, by clicking on it, I can get suggestions. So let's click on keywords. And as you guys can see, I was already playing around with it. And um, because my web page talks about healthy food, I'll just write the basic theme of my web page here in the left side of the screen, just healthy recipes. And click search a whole bunch of words will appear, keywords will appear, and you can choose, I could choose the most relevant, uh, relevant ones for my web page. As you guys can see, it says recipes, chicken, healthy, healthy recipes, chicken, chicken, healthy recipes. So plays around with the words, um, finding, just find the most appropriate one for you. And uh, if you like one of them, for example, in one, in one of my web pages I have, a chicken recipe. So I can just click on the plus sign next to the keyword I think um, it's appropriate and the plus sign will disappear letting me know that I've already chose this keyword. And now on the right of the side of the screen you guys can see that my word was added here at the end. And it was added to what they call the group. You can have as many groups as you want and to the right side of the um, of the name, it says the number of keywords you have. The most, you, it's appropriate to have 20 to 40 keywords in your web pages. And if you want to add a group for a different web page, you just uh, hit the plus sign and enter a new name and then uh, click OK. So now I'm going to close this window and show you another, another feature that I thought it was important and it was competitor spy. So I click on it, and you guys can see that you can enter any web page of uh, a competitor, and it will give you information about it. I only know a few uh, competitors because I actually use them for myself. So I'm gonna go to Sasha Fitness. She is a Venezuelan 
own lady that works out a lot and gives important recipes for people and helps with works out, workouts and everything. So it explains that out of five, it only has one star, and it tells you that SashaFitness.com has two rankings in Google Organic Top 50 results, which is good, but not as good. It also provides you with information like uh, the website has top 50 uh, has top 50 rankings in Google's organic results for two keywords. Obviously, it'll it will only give me one because if I wanted to see more, uh, I would have to pay. And this is just a demo version, and I can do much with it. And it also gives you uh, 10 more websites that compete with it that compete with Sasha Fitness for the same keywords in the organic results and it only gives me five half as much just because it's a demo version if i wanted to do more i would have to click here and it will take me to a web page and it will ask me to pay and i won't do that because we're looking for free or upgrade now and get more information this was another important feature lastly that i thought it was relevant was hitting here in optimization you click here and you can create a report you will create a report and um, you can edit it view as web page you can view it as Adobe Reader document I was not able to do that because I have I don't have um, Adobe, Re Adobe Reader yet but you can still View it as a Microsoft Word document, which I already saved in my desktop. So by minimizing everything, I'm able to see my report up here. I click on my report after I saved it. It should open up in every second. And it is really detailed, but again, it won't give me as much information just because it is the demo version. But... I'll just let you know what it talks about in really brief words. It has a cover page, uh, basically basically giving you permission and telling you what's happening here. And then it will go ahead and talk, uh, give me a report overview about my competitors. And it gives me a whole bunch of information about them, like the titles, description, and everything else. It will also go ahead and later on talk about um, the keywords, the keywords, my keywords, my key, uh, the competitors' keywords, and whatever it's in yellow is that it's not as good. Oh, red, it's terrible because I'm not a great um, web page helper or doer or anything. And when I have a green, it's I'm okay and I fortunately have more greens later on but not right now as you guys can you guys can see it says for many of the advices that this piece of advice is not available in the free demo version so boo will have to pay if we want to actually get advice and this is what will happen for the rest of the document so yes, this is all I wanted to show if you guys uh, want to play around with it, just you can get it for free.